Morning, Year Six. Final lesson this week before we've got a spelling test tomorrow. So today's lesson is going to be mainly focused around practicing those spellings. Now, I'm going to show you one method that we've used before to practice our spellings. So you've got your words there, and the method that I'm going to suggest um, using is the look, say, cover, write, check method. So looking at those words here on the left hand side okay look at the word is there anything you notice can you remember those that rule that we're looking at this week the letters that will form that o sound make sure you're selecting the right one every time look at the word spot those things that you're going to have to remember say the word out loud really important to hear how the word sounds and relate that to those letters that you can see then i'd like to cover them up have your first attempt now it's really important to check every time to make sure please do not copy the same spelling incorrect in the incorrect way three times so after every attempt check it remember what we do in class go along every letter should have a little tick above it to say that it's correct that way you're really clear that you've got the right spelling every single time so i don't mind whether you do your first attempt column for all 10 words first and then move on or whether you do each individual word so you do one word and then you practice it three times checking after each that's totally up to you now if you think actually there are some of these words which you're really unsure of and you've got another method which you often use which helps you to remember your spellings maybe some of you will choose to use the pyramid method then that's absolutely fine and I'd love to see your pictures sent in to me later on Dojo of some diff different methods that you think work for you. So this is what I'm suggesting. However, if you'd prefer to use a different method, then you're more than welcome to do that. So practicing those spellings today, tomorrow we'll be doing a spelling test.